Okay, and the reason I said this was because, like, I feel like most, if not, like, majority of the time, men in general are just usually working the higher paying jobs, you know, because they work more of the, like, hard labor type jobs, whereas, like, women are in, like, other fields of work. So, specifically, the guy who I was talking to, like, who I made the video about, he said he was, like, some kind of, like, engineer type thing. He's making, like, hella money and stuff like this. So, he was basically, like, bragging to me in the beginning that he makes like he's like oh i got a lot of money blah 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 so when he was asking like to split the data you know like i pay for half he pays for half i was confused because i'm like you were just here bragging about how much money you make literally like three times as much as me and he was trying to like force me to pay for half the date so that's where i was like what the fuck you know, like, this is feminine as hell, like, because me personally, if, if if a man is coming to me, asking me out, he's pursuing me, he's trying to court me, I'm not paying for shit on the first date, okay, like, uh, like, all the men in the comments were coming at me, they're like, oh, you can't do 50-50, that's crazy, whole time, I don't feel like any woman should accept 50-50 low-key, but, um, that's mostly because men are just make, naturally making more, um, but no, I said like three times as much because that's how much he was making, okay? Like, sure, not everybody can do that. Cool. But um, no, in general, I just I would just rather prefer a man, a man to ask me to pay for the first eight because I feel like whoever is asking each other out, they should be the one paying. And me personally, I am not going to ask a man out in my life, okay? I'm just not like that like sure some men like when the girls make the first move but no i'm not like that like i'm submissive i want like a dominant man who's gonna come to me and plan the date take me on the date pay for the date okay um but no that's why i said three times as much i know not everybody's like rich or like making a lot of money or whatever and it's not even about money okay because even if like he he could be rich but then he could take me on, like, a decent date, like, not a lot of money required. I would still be okay with that. But it's the fact that he was bragging about his money. So, I don't know. Maybe I should have posted that part. But, um, no, I don't really care about, like, how much money the date is. As long as there's, like, some kind of planning and effort involved, that's what I care about. So, in the post, I was asking him, like, oh, like, what would you just plan for a date? Like, if I didn't tell you anything about myself or what I like to do what would you like what would you plan and he was like uh i don't know something fun so that's when i was like are you for real because of course it's gonna be something fun but like what would you do so like the fact that he didn't take the effort to at least like google some fun date ideas that's where i was like what the fuck you know the fact that he said that answer i was like dang is he slow is he less educated than me i don't know so that was basically what made me like lose interest in him like right off the bat don't even matter that he was talking about money or like 50 50 or whatever i just didn't like the fact that he couldn't plan a first date because if you can't plan if you can't plan one date how the fuck are you gonna plan 100 dates for the next 60 years of our lives together you know so i'm trying to find a planner that's why i i was mentioning all that okay